In order to use the SMS messaging system, go to SMS. First, we'll need to create a list. You can do this by clicking Create and then adding your criteria from the drop-down menu here. Once you're finished, you can click Submit to view a count of the voters in your filtered list. And when you're finished here, click in the text box, name your list, and then click Save. Once you have done this, you should get a system message saying that your list has been saved. And from here, you can go to SMS Manage to view your saved list. Now, in order to create an SMS campaign, select your saved list and click Create SMS Campaign. Here you'll get a pop-up window where you can enter the name of your campaign, the text of the SMS message you wish to send, you can add an image file, you can also add a link, and then you must click this disclosure box before clicking Create. That will take you back to the main SMS screen, and you can see that your SMS campaign has been scheduled. And it will display the name, status, which in this case is not started, total cell count, queued count, which is the number of messages that are queued to be delivered, how many have been sent, and how many failed. You can also click the blue options button to view your SMS message.